<laughs> Welcome to the 31 Nights of Macaween. Every night on the 9th of October, I review one spooky movie. Come and join if you dare. <laughs> this has to be one of the most obscure yet remembered horror films I can recall in recent memories. I remember back in 2018, everyone I knew was talking about Hellfest. It came out at the right time during the Halloween season, and then after it was over, it was forgotten. And, to be frank with you, I can see why. Hellfest is a bad film, there's actually some good ideas and elements of the film that I enjoy. I enjoyed the concept of the killer. Blending in as a scare actor at a haunted theme park is really interesting. It makes the film more tense and makes you on edge. It puts you in the same mindset of the characters wondering what's real and what is a part of the show. And the kills in the film were really unique and a bit brutal. The team were very creative while coming up with clever ways to kill the characters, my favorites being the strong hammer and guillotine. Those were cool, but besides those, the film is painfully average. It's not memorable to the casual viewer, and that can hurt the film's viewing experience. The characters in the film were a bit bland and annoying. The main character was the stereotypical final girl. Her friends were just victims one to five. Nothing more to say there. The writing was a bit wonky. I don't want to say first draft material, but it was my first draft material. It just seemed like the way the film was written. It was made to get the characters from point A see something scary, be chased or stalked by the killer, killed to point B and repeat. At a point it gets boring to watch because you already know what's going to happen. That's not a good recipe to have in your slasher film. Hellfest was released on September 28, 2018 on a budget of $5.5 .5 million. After its run at the box office, it would go on to gross $18.2 million. Overall, while I can appreciate Hellfest being a throwback to the classic days of the slasher genre, it isn't quite enough to be an enjoyable film. I guess if you're looking for a generic horror film in the background of your Halloween party, put on Hellfest, you'll get some eyes on it. Final grade, B+. This is fun! <laughs> 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 <laughs>